is your election authority and of course you know this we are counting down to the big day coming up tomorrow just over 12 hours and 27 minutes right now as a matter of fact as you look at the clock countdown right there uh, 12 hours and a lot can happen right here in Connecticut but some voters are rushing to get their absentee ballots in right now channel 3 eyewitness news reporter Mike Savino is live he's in Bloomfield with more details Mike uh, what should voters look for coming up tomorrow well, Mark, if you still have your absentee ballots, then the best bet is to bring them at these absentee ballot drop boxes that you'll see at your town halls. Some towns even have two of them. But if you miss today's deadline to get your absentee ballot, well, then you need to vote in person. I had planned to, and then we kind of, you know, waffle. So then we decided tomorrow probably be a zoo. Today was the deadline to request an absentee ballot, and many town halls looked like this. Voters lined up to get their ballots. Picking up and returning ballots in person now is the only way to ensure your vote makes it before polls close tomorrow. The mail and stuff and, you know, what's going on in Texas with, the, you know, the game what they're playing with, you know, the driving registration and all that other stuff. Many voters said they didn't want to risk having their ballot delivered by mail. A federal judge has ordered that the U.S. Postal Service make absentee ballots a priority, but Connecticut requires that ballots be returned to town hall by 8 p.m. on election night. More than 600,000 absentee ballots have been returned as of this morning. It has been well received by the public. If you miss today's deadline to get an absentee ballot, you'll have to go to the polls. More than 10,000 volunteers statewide will be helping voters through the process. We are ready. Uh, our polling stations, we're following CDC guidelines. Now you can track your poll or your, your uh, ballot rather online. But if you bring your ballot in on Tuesday, tomorrow on Election Day, it will not be counted until after the polls close. This is to make sure that nobody votes in person and by absentee ballot. Live from Bloomfield, Mike Savito, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.